Welcome. In this video, I want us to discuss about how to engage students on online teaching and learning. My name is Dr. Kibet. Engaging students is hard enough in a physical classroom, but likely it may turn out that the tricks you may use there might work just as well as in online teaching. Developing skills for teaching and learning online has not just become important recently. Much when so, much has changed due to the corona pandemic. Blended teaching, which is basically the same as what we now call as hybrid learning, isn't new and more importantly, it isn't going away anytime soon. So in this video, I want to discuss the ways that teachers can use to engage students on online teaching and learning. Point number one, be available. Being, being present for your students can be really tricky when it comes to online and hybrid teaching. And yet, at the end of the day, it's what will open the door to most of the other ways to increase students' engagement. Creating an environment where you are available, understanding and helpful will make your students more open and motivate, motivated to communicate. Point number two, engage students with interesting educational materials. You can either prepare or find materials regarding the topic that are easier to digest or even design to be a little extraordinary. This will be perfect if your goal is to make your lessons more interactive and will naturally encourage students' engagement. Videos, digital whiteboards, etc. will help here. Point number three, organizations with your students. The next engaging strategy for online learning needs to leads no, needs no introduction. One-to-one -one student teacher sessions are crucial, especially when it comes to students who are having some difficulties and progressing slower than others. Giving them special attention and arranging some extra time to walk them through topics they struggle with will be beneficial to their understanding and will definitely increase their engagement. Point number four. Increase students' engagement with group work. Well-planned group work can be the perfect opportunity for students to polish their social skills and learn to cooperate with one another. Point number five. Start an online class forum to engage students in discussions. Some students have, have a much easier time typing out their thoughts rather than saying them out loud in front of the whole class. An online discussion space can be a great opportunity for everyone to participate, keep their opinions, get to know their views of others and learn the rules of polite conversation. Point number six, provide regular feedback when teaching online. Providing regular feedback is important in any teaching environment and it's also important that your students learn to take it as well as give it. When it comes to hybrid and online teaching and learning, giving regular feedback is extra important and it will also help students to get in more engaged in their learning. Point number seven, challenges will engage students. Engagement in online learning may sometimes increase if you simply require more of your students. Some students are more motivated if challenged. Of course, this doesn't mean you should push too hard or make them feel pressured, but being a good teacher also means knowing how to require effort. Challenging student, students is an opportunity for them to learn how to take risks, whether they win or lose and then move on and try again.
Point number eight. Encourage students by utilizing live captions in online learning. Live captions not only make videos more accessible to everyone, but also keep students engaged in sound-sensitive environments. While many students who are hard of hearing rely on captions to learn and retain course materials, a study has also discovered that 80% of individuals who use captions don't have hearing impairment. Virtual classes must have accurate live captions since any inaccuracies can negatively impact students' learning and performance. Point number nine. Visual aids in course materials keep students engaged. Just as visual aids are essential in a classroom setting, they are also crucial in online teaching and learning, to make lessons more effective and easily understandable. According to research, an individual is 65 more likely to remember something that includes a graphic compared to just a text by itself. Whether it's a photograph, a video, a slideshow, a graph, or a model, visual aids have been known to make difficult concepts easy to digest, assist lecture retention, and keep students more engaged. Point number 10. Increase student engagement by testing their knowledge. Online learning sometimes makes it difficult for instructors to assess students' understanding of, of course materials. Therefore, virtual classes with clearly graded curriculums allow educators to gauge whether students have successfully processed lessons and also allow both parties to quantify their progress. In fact, research found that tests, including pop quizzes, are valuable tools that improve students' learning retentions. Point number 11, include work examples in course content. Studies have found that students or non-experts learn more effectively through detailed explanation of solved examples as opposed to attempting to solve them. Therefore, to help students comprehend the course content and assure that they can successfully complete the homework, instructors should spend leading the class through step-by-step -step solution of examples that are similar to the day's lesson. And finally, point number 12. Create interactive content to improve online learning experiences. One of the best ways to encourage students to participate in class and stay engaged is by creating online lessons that are interactive, that are interactive. Interactive lessons help increase a student's energy, which in turn promotes cooperation with others and improve communication skills. That brings us to the end of this video uh, presentation where I have taken some few minutes to explain how to engage students on online teaching and learning. If you like my video, kindly subscribe. You can like or even share. Thank you.